background. Created as an extension to the world of the theory of reasoned action, the technology acceptance model corresponds to one of the most renowned, analyzed, and studied models in the literature. This model seeks to understand how and why users accept and use a technology, using perceived ease of use and perceived usefulness as prediction variables of the intention to use. TAM2 was created after TAM and explains the intentions to use a specific technology in terms of social influence and cognitive processes. To this end, the model incorporates constructs such as subjective norm, image, job relevance, output quality, result demonstrability, experience, and voluntariness. Three years later, the unified theory of acceptance and use of technology come to the fore. This theory seeks to predict the intention to use through the variable performance expectancy, effort expectancy, and social influence, which are defined in a way very similar to perceived usefulness, perceived ease of use, and subjective norm, respectively. This set of variables adds up to facilitating conditions, which have a direct effect on usage behavior, and is defined as the extent to which the individual believes that certain organizational and technical infrastructures exist to support the use of a system. Two new variables incorporated into the model correspond to gender and age, which are moderating variables, as well as experience and voluntariness. The UTOT2 emerged more recently, as an extension of the UTOT and to study the acceptance and use of technologies in a consumption context. This model incorporates three new variables, namely, hedonic motivation, price value, and habit. As for social networks, several authors attempt to explain the use of online social networks, OSNs. According to Schneider et al., users commonly spend more than half an hour interacting with OSNs, and the byte contributions per OSN session are relatively small. From this result, we could assume that most users are consumers and not content creators. In the case of Facecourse, Ellison et al. proposed that this network might provide greater benefits for users experiencing low self-esteem and low life satisfaction. As for Twitter, Java et al. suggests that people use microblogging to talk about their daily activities and to seek or share information. With respect to Instagram, Motives were positively associated with both usage and self-presentation. People use social networks such as Facecourse, Twitter, and Instagram for the sole purpose of entertainment and maintaining contacts with their friends list. As may be seen, the motivations to use social networks are varied. According to Brandseg and Heim, people use social networks to get in contact with new people, to keep in touch with their friends, and general socializing and this could be closely related to the variable social influence proposed as a latent exogenous variable in the UTOT2. Shu et al. also suggested that user utilitarian gratifications of immediate access and coordination, hedonic gratifications of affection and leisure, which could be related to perceived usefulness and perceived ease of use, respectively, and website social presence were three positive predictors of social network site usage. Regarding WhatsApp, there are specific motivators linked to cost, sense of community, and immediacy, as well as to unlocking new opportunities for intimate communication, addictive behaviors have even been detected toward the application. A number of studies about the use of this innovative technology have been conducted, which have detected a series of factors that positively or negatively influence the use of WhatsApp, such as the importance of family groups, the use of status within the application, interactions with the education field, and concerns about privacy, among others. This study intends to analyze WhatsApp consumer behavior from the perspective of the variables that influence the intention to use this technology and to determine what these variables are and how they articulate to affect the intention to use WhatsApp, using the variables proposed in the UTOT2 model.